So hello and welcome to I'm back to my channel and um, thanks for stopping by. So today's video I wanted to do a little video on a product that is new to me. No, it's not new to the world. I think it's been out for quite a long time, but it's taken me a really long time to actually get my hands on um, this particular product, which is from Maybelline. So you can tell by the title. So I've got some on my eye. Um, yeah, so from Maybelline. So I picked something up on the internet a little while back, and I did a video on that. Now I, th I, I thought that was what this is. However, I don't think it was, but I will link that just so you can have a little look. Um, but I am going to review, or at least just test out this uh, Maybelline, what's it called, Instant Age Rewind, um, and just see if it's worth the hype. So, before we get cracking onto the video, if I could ask you to hit that subscribe button down below, or there, or there, or wherever it is, and also don't forget to hit that notification bell so you're notified as to and when I upload a video. And yeah, I'll share it as well. I always forget to say share. So if you you know do you like the video, share the video. Please help help a sister out. Um so enough rambling from me. I think I've covered everything I wanted to cover. Um so I'll just get to applying said makeup. So see you over there. Right, so I come fresh faced, cleansed, moisturized, all that good stuff. Um, so obviously the focus of this video is the Maybelline and I will show you it here and the Maybelline, what's it, instant, oh, okay, so it says instant anti-age eraser concealer with goji berry and something else. Now I picked this up in 11 tan, now I think this is one of the newer shades um, and if I'll be honest I'm not too sure because some of the other videos that I've watched um, they seem to be a little bit darker, but this is the darkest one that I managed to pick up in the UK. And I picked this up in Superdrug. Superdrug, I picked this up. And I must admit, when it actually first came out, this is kind of, I should be putting makeup on as we speak, actually, because I'm, you know, making this video like 10 times long. Um, so, yeah, so when I, initially when it came out, uh, I'm using the Becca Luminous Perfecting Foundation on set face. Um, it's a bit of a get ready with me, actually, because I'm actually on my, on my way. So let's get to this. So anyway, as I was saying, yeah, so when it first came out, obviously, like everybody else, I wanted to try it. Um, but it was nowhere to be found. So I actually tweeted, um, mainly, I'm like, okay, when's this coming to the UK? It seems to be everywhere else, but, you know, when's it coming? Oh, it'll be soon. I kid you not. I picked this up about two weeks ago in the UK. Now, you guys know how long this has been out and I only managed to pick it up. Now that I've not been trying. I only managed to pick it up about two weeks ago. Um, again, every, I know, <laughs> I know us, us UK, you, you know, people from the UK complain all the time. When it just comes to new products, we just, we have to wait so long um, for anything to come in. And by the time it's come in, it, you know, it's, it's not everybody's kind of, you know, onto the new thing, so it is a bit frustrating. Um, but yeah, so I've I bought it because I wanted to obviously try it. Everybody's tried it and it looks really nice, so so I went to have a go. So it was, I've washed, washed it as well, so I'm just, um, I didn't have much time to do anything too fancy schmancy with this, so I'm just doing it. Um, what do they call it? Just, just, do you just. Not much, but you know, you feel like you're having a good skin day. I feel like I'm having a good skin day. But I do feel, I do feel at the, um, one of the main reasons why I've been having good skin days of late is the um, ordinary, like exfoliator liquid thing. I did a video, um, actually, did, yeah, I did a video on that as, as one of my favourites, so I'll link that somewhere here as well. Because um, that, oh, it was awesome and I do feel... Uh, I mean, I don't think I've got terrible skin anyway. However, I do feel like that has really just kind of, you know, given me that little fresh look that I like. So I'm just going to do my brows um, really quickly. And I'm using the um, MYX Micro Brow Pencil. And I have this in Noir, which is black. There you go. So I'm going to use that and just do that quickly. Oh, 
I don't do to go too fancy with the brows, but I'll, I'll speed this little bit of this bit up for you guys. Ooh. To give them a quick brush through brows I don't do this whole sometimes I do it like under the under the brows the blah 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 but yeah I haven't got time for that today so those are the brows done and then I'm gonna I wanna just put a little bit of I'm not putting any what's it called eyeshadow on oh sorry I've got my, my beard on it's get cold and yes I do love New York love it so I'm going to just um, lightly just line um, very close to my lash line just to kind of help um, make my lashes look a little bit thicker and I'm using the um, what's this one? Soap and Glory Super Cat Brilliant um, Liquid Liner this Absolutely lovely, I'll show you Ooh, Very black, just, what's, just what I need so I'm just going to line that very quickly, literally just as close to the line as I can, eyelash line. Just pop that on, hope you can see. So we got to do if you can't. Uh, uh, uh. And I just find that it just, especially when you're not wearing any, um, what's it called? Shadow. Just helps make your uh, lashes look thicker from the base. And I, uh, yeah, I like that. I like the look, I like that look, so yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> Mascara I'm going to use today is going to be the Mali, what's this called? Oh, Mali Mascara, There's, there is a name for it. I can't remember what the name is, I'll show you there. I'll put all the, um, excuse me, the names of everything down below, but yeah, I, this is one of the, um, her famous ones anyway. And it is a decent mascara, I'm not gonna lie. Um so I'll just pop that on very quickly. <laughs> And then what I have been doing of late is using a um, lash comb, which I don't know why I've never used one before because it's brilliant. Um, I find I, I have had I have had my lashes um, what called LVL'd. That was quite a little bit of a while ago. But as you can see, I've got you know I feel like I've got decent lashes. I think they're alright. Um, so I'm just going to give them a little comb through just to make sure they are separated. I like my lashes to be separated. I don't want to be clumped up. And on the same on this side, ta da da. And I can't remember where I got this comb from actually. I think it was in a set of something. Really cheap, but you know what? Does a goddamn job. Um, so I'm just gonna shove on another coat of this. And I am going to do the bottom lash, but I don't put too much on. Actually, no, I'll do it after I put on the concealer. So I'm going to do that now, actually. You can see on our door. This is literally brand, brand new, brand spanking new. I've not even opened it. Um, so let's give it a try. I'm a bit nervous. It just, I don't know. I've, I looked at it and I do have the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. And if I'm being honest, it's, it, colour-wise, it doesn't look far off that colour. But I don't know, when you're in this... Story when you swatch it, it just looks so light. You're like, God damn, is, is that too light? Um, but anyway, so let's do the whole. God, I think it's hit it. Oh, is it? Is it? Yeah, you can see it coming, it's changing colour. 
as you can see. Can you see it there? And I'll do a little bit more so you can see it. So I'm not putting, I'm not going to do this whole big triangle business. I don't tend to do the big triangle business. Look at my little laughter lines so while they do me. I didn't kind of see you on the camera, but trust me, they're there. And so I'm going to pop, ooh, see, ooh, cha. Yeah. Um, okay. I'm, I'm going to do a little bit. Yeah, that's enough for me. And then, I mean, the whole point, I suppose, is to use this sponge thing. However, I'm going to like use, I, I love this um, concealer buffer. It's um, by Zoe, Zoeva142. That's the name of it. Can you see? Oh, brilliant, brilliant brush. I like, the, I do have the beauty blender. I don't mind that, but sometimes I just find it a little bit um difficult like getting in really close to the and under the eye so um yeah mm. <clears throat> yeah so i'm going to use my so we have a brush that's so been sat on for a little while like oh I need okay it will make that face right <laughs> So I'm going to take it down a little bit, already. okay. Hmm. Okay, I don't, I don't hate it. I don't know what you guys think. Hmm, yeah. So far, so good. Okay, like that. I say, I just I I tend just to put a little bit on, and then just I say I'll be able to go right up into there because I've got a couple of, a little bit of creasing creases on there. Um, so yeah, okay. I like I like it. I like it. And I'm just gonna go with my beauty blender and make sure it's all blended. You know, blend it out there. Mmm. Looks really nice on said so camera. And I, I do actually like it. Well, so, the, I mean, the test will be obviously how it wears. So, colour wise, I'm, I'm, I'm cool with it. And I'm just going to use my um, Sasha Bar Cup just to put um, set under the eye. Just a tiny, tiny bit. And I use the tiniest bit that's what i use literally the tiniest bit and i just give it a little thing i, I don't even have to, i'm not baking it i'm not doing none of that business it just literally goes under like so 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 and i'm literally just using the excess excess even what's in the cap <laughs> um so yeah okay so that's that's done that's done yes uh, i feel like it's grabbed a little bit in the corner but Okay, that's done. Um, now that's done, I'm just going to do my bottom lashes. Lash, 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 lash. Very quick, really just. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So that's done, brows done. And literally, literally, I'm finished. Only thing I'm going to do now, only thing I'm going to do now is put on a little bit of, um, do, I'm going to just do a nude lip. I, 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 yeah, just going to do a nude lip. And this, oh, sorry, this is Max um, Lip Liner in Chestnut. And then this, um, oh, this is another one by Zoeva. Um, it's a lip crayon. And it's called Second Chance. I think I picked pick this up in um, a like a one of them gift boxes, you know, like a um, whole oh, subscription box. And it's just like little pink colour. I'll swatch it for you. Yeah, just like that. I didn't, literally, I'm just going to pop it in the centre and nude it out. As you can see, it's very light. So. I 
to just skip it around. Yeah. That's it, folks. Says I'm done. I think that's come on, that's got to be like quickest makeup. Quickest makeup. Um, so hair's done. I'm going to take this down very quickly. Um, so as I say, I've literally just oh, look at that. I'm gonna see <laughs> the tips where I put the foundation. Where I haven't put the foundation, which I didn't think about. That is so funny. Um, so yeah, don't forget to, to leave your foundation up, guys, when you're doing these things. But again, it, there you go, it's done. It's just stay uh, with me. Where my ting, my ting was. See, see that gone. Um, yeah, so that's my final look. Um, mm -hmm. so let me know what, let me know what you think. I like it. I've, I, 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 as I said, I was very nervous um, with the colour, um, but I do feel, I feel again. I'm looking on my monitor, but I do feel like it looks okay. Um, it is brightening, and, and as you saw, I only put on a little bit. I didn't put on loads. Uh, but I think that's enough. I think if I was going out of an, e of an evening, I think I'd probably put on a little bit more. But, you know, this is just kind of a really light, light makeup. So let me know what you think. Um, yeah, so that is it, guys. So thank you so much for watching. And again, if you haven't already done so, hit the subscribe button. <laughs> hit it. And I'll also leave a couple of videos um, over here for you to have a look at. Also, if you're interested in seeing what I've been up to. Um, other videos I've had and stuff and I will see you in the next video guys